Hi everyone and welcome to the Ukrainian club in Holland Park West. It's been three years since the last Ukrainian festival and the weather gods have definitely um, brought our wishes on bringing perfect weather today. A little bit cloudy which is just right, it's going to be a hot one. There's so much food here and it's literally just starting and it's already packed so it's promising to be a sellout. Um, there's going to be amazing performances, there's going to be some great stalls and of course we are here to support the Ukrainian community and all the displaced people that have come here from Ukraine. So Slava Ukraina, uh, welcome to Outback Polax. Don't forget to subscribe, like and share and stick with us, it's going to be a great festival. Hi, I'm Peter Bongiorni, President of the Ukrainian Community of Queensland. Today we're here at our community centre at Holland Park West, uh, commemorating Ukraine Defenders Day, which is a public holiday dedicated to the defenders of Ukraine, the, the military of Ukraine, which is more important than ever, given the ongoing crisis and war uh, that Russia is waging against Ukraine. So we've got dozens of people that are here helping and supporting us with uh, volunteering and we're, we're expecting uh, uh, over a thousand people here today to come support us uh, here at the Ukrainian Festival in Brisbane. Thank you everyone. G'day everybody, my name is Adam Miljenovic, I'm the Vice President of the Ukrainian Community of Queensland. I'd love to say Slava Ukraini and I want to welcome everybody to today's Brisbane's Ukrainian Festival 2022. We're very happy to have such a massive turnout. It's not even started and we've already got a couple of hundred people here. We have saws handcrafted in Ukraine and everything around the place. Please. We hope everyone's going to have a fantastic day today. We're really excited. The weather's turned out perfectly. The crowds are turning up. We've had dozens of volunteers helping us put it all together. So everyone, please come have a little uh, Nazdorovia and we'll catch you around. I'm Svetlana Yarosh. I'm from Ukrainian community. Um, looks like our festival very, very great. It's just the beginning, but the last one we held was um, 2019, so three years, and lots of things been changed. We grow bigger because we had lots of uh, displaced people. Unfortunately, event happening in Ukraine now, so we feel very, very big support and help from everybody's around. So we just thought we might organize a big event, big festival, to share our community, um, uh, the, the spirit of our community with everyone to show our culture to share beautiful food and just uh, say thanks to everybody for your support and see perhaps see each other thank you
We stand here today because we stand with Ukraine. Democracy can be defended and people are willing to fight. Uh, the Labor Party certainly stands in absolute solidarity with the Ukrainian people. Australia will stand side by side with the Ukrainian people in their time of need. To support the, the people of Ukraine and to support freedom and democracy. Thank you. We stand with you and you are an inspiration to many. Mesavani Stoyamo. Mesavani Stoyamo. Slava Ukraina. Rojem Slava. Czuję, że to, co się dzieje w Ukrainie, to jest również moja sprawa, moja wielka sprawa. To jest sprawa mojej wolności. I dlatego dzisiaj tutaj jestem. Jestem również z innego powodu. Jestem dumny z polskiego narodu za to, jak, jaki ma stosunek do tego, co się dzieje w tej chwili w Ukrainie. Jako mały chłopiec kiedyś przeczytałem książeczkę, która nie była zbyt gruba, ale tytuł jej pozostał do dzisiaj w mojej głowie. A tytuł brzmiał Polska jest wszędzie, gdzie bronią wolności. Dziękuję. What a wonderful day it was today at the Ukrainian festival. Uh, the weather gods have pl played really well. It's been a beautiful day. Uh, thank God the clouds are coming because I think I'm a little bit sunburnt. Um, it was fantastic. So many amazing performances. Um, such a surprise from the Vietnamese community as well. Uh, Obertas, the Ukrainian dancers. I couldn't believe the little girls singing as well. That was so beautiful. So much food. Uh, and I think a lot of the stalls are empty. So I didn't get a lot to eat myself. So I'm going to go and try to score some nice food, maybe a beer as well. I hope this place uh, opens up next year again for another festival. And I hope you guys raised a lot of money for the uh, Ukrainian crisis appeal. Um, it was so wonderful to see everyone come together. Hope to see you next time. <laughs>